Hello everyone, welcome to the short technical analysis on Bitcoin. In this video I will showcase a small technical analysis on the pair uh, Bitcoin USD at Coinbase. Uh, and I'm doing this on TradingView. And this is my way of analyzing different assets like Forex, stocks and crypto. So if you do not like it or do it differently yourself, that is fine. Uh, this works for me and if you have something that works, uh, that's great for you too. I, choo I chose to do a showcase for my technical analysis on Bitcoin because cryptocurrency uh, have gained a massive influx of new people and investors again. Uh, and I think a lot of people are interested into looking at some technical analysis by other people. Uh, this technical analysis is without like real indicators. It is with uh, exponential moving averages, but okay. Um, and it's mostly based on price action. Uh, therefore, it's good to know big fundamental news like last week's uh, news about Tesla, uh, Tesla no longer accepting Bitcoin uh, will make this analysis practically worthless uh, if it hits the uh, price points I will give you. Uh, first off I will showcase the tools I use and afterwards I will give you my two points where I think you could best sell from or buy from uh, but I would prefer buying because my stance on Bitcoin is very bullish for now. So let us start with the indicators, let us start with the exponential moving averages. Uh, I have put four different EMAs on this chart with the periods uh, 28, 50, 100 and 200, where the higher the time frame uh, means I find it more reliable. Uh, I have also color coded them as you, as you see here, but that is just how I do it. Uh, so I use these EMAs to look for support or resistance on these lines, on the EMAs, and also a little bit of seeing uh, what way the price is going. Uh, as you can see, I have also drawn three uh, trend lines, uh, which I use to spot good entries. Um, and in this instance, I have drawn two ascending ones and uh, one as uh, descending one. Uh, right here, there is uh, one Fibonacci as well, uh, drawn with my rules. I've set for uh, Fibonacci retracement in this case, uh, which I found to be the most reliable when backtesting. And if you want to know more on this technique, I, I, I can make a video uh, about it, just uh, just tell me. Uh, I have very specific rules on where I can draw Fibonacci's and whether I can extend them and stuff. Uh, and lastly, uh, as you can see here, I marked some zones with gray rectangles to show areas of interest where price has resisted or uh, supported multiple times over the last period of time. And by the way, this chart is on the daily time frame as I think the higher the time frame um, is better when you analyze volatile markets uh, as Bitcoin um, you could call it a, vo a very volatile market uh, especially this year uh, now on to the probably the most interesting parts uh, what are the best moments to sell or buy the Bitcoin at this moment in my opinion and you should note that this is not financial advice this is just how i look at the market and the way i will enter my bitcoin trades uh, which i will do so we'll start with my buy area my buy area is marked with a green rectangle as you can see here and this is based on the gray box the 61.8 fibonacci level the 200 exponential moving average and uh, with the 40,000 psychological uh, key level nearby uh, I would not uh, trade this signal like short-term trade but I would see this as a long-term hold area uh, everything lines up very well and I will probably enter this position at the top of the gray box so right here to make sure that I will not miss it I think this is quite strong uh, and it lasts uh, quite long as well I think at least until the 7th of June. It also depends a little bit on what the 200 exponential moving average is doing because I find that very strong price has supported uh, on this uh, a lot. So if this goes above the box, I will have to revise. Uh, my sell area is marked with the red rectangle and while the buy area is valid for a long time, um, I would suggest to only enter a short position here till the uh, 26th of May. Um, at the max. The reason for this position is the retest of, uh, of of a trend line, this one, the ascending one, and the third touch of the descending trend line, together with a $56,000 psychological key level. 
and this idea is less strong than the buy idea due to less indicators uh, but also the bullish nature I think Bitcoin has I would enter this position shortly so trade it or buy the dip it causes if it does um, and I don't really see any good areas of where to buy that dip but that would be the most secure uh, way of using this area